everybody, welcome back to our YouTube channel. My name is Dr. Mike Blaney, bariatric surgeon in Augusta, Georgia, and today we're going to talk about sleep apnea and weight loss surgery and how weight loss cures sleep apnea. So what is sleep apnea? Sleep apnea is a condition where when we're relaxed and we're asleep, our airway, our upper airway in our throat, the soft tissue collapses on itself and obstructs our ability to breathe. This obviously results in snoring. So one of the first most obvious signs of somebody having sleep apnea is snoring. Another component to the disease process is intermittent uh, arrests of breathing. The patient will stop breathing for a period of time and for an individual observing somebody with sleep apnea, uh, you'll notice that they may not take a breath for 10 or 15 seconds. As a result, this tends to result in a rise in our carbon dioxide level in our bloodstream because we're not ventilating. Ventilating is the process of exchanging gases. So when we're asleep, we obviously need to breathe. So sleep apnea is a condition of the airways collapsing, resulting in us stopping breathing for periods of time and the accumulation of carbon dioxide in our bloodstream. Overweight individuals tend to be more prone to sleep apnea. Now, certainly, normal weight individuals can have sleep apnea. It's just much more common in our overweight patient population. And that's simply because of the extra soft tissue around the, the head and the neck region of uh, most overweight individuals. The treatment for sleep apnea, if you have it, is, is a CPAP machine. You've probably heard of this before. A CPAP machine is a mask that goes over the uh, nose and the mouth or, or just the nose. If you're a mouth breather, then uh, mask over the nose is not going to work. So it's a mask that uh, applies positive pressure to the airways while you're asleep so that it tends to hold open the soft tissue in the in the throat region, allowing an individual to continue to exchange uh, oxygen and carbon dioxide as they breathe. Uh, the reason weight loss surgery tends to cure sleep apnea is, is simple. You've lost a lot of weight. You've lost weight everywhere on your body to include adipose tissue, the soft tissue around the head and the neck. So the tendency to obstruct the airway uh, after we've lost a bunch of weight tends to be less likely. But sometimes people do lose a lot of weight and still have some degree of sleep apnea and still may need their CPAP machine. So what's all the fuss about sleep apnea anyway? Well, it's a dangerous condition. Um, if our carbon dioxide level rises too high, this can result in heart arrhythmias, heartbeat irregularities. And this may be the number one reason that somebody might die in their sleep is that they have severe obstructive sleep apnea, the carbon dioxide level rises to a level that, that their heart doesn't tolerate and they end up with a funky heart rhythm that can then um, potentially kill them. So obstructive sleep apnea is truly a, a dangerous condition and weight loss surgery is a great treatment option to reduce the likelihood of, of having a fatal event. So if you find these topics interesting, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Do I need to point? Be sure to like this video and hit the notification bell.